Hello, welcome back. We are doing, would you say this is a get ready with me? Sure. Yeah. Am I getting ready? We're getting ready. I'm getting ready, but I have help today. Um, this is Santos. Say hello. hello. Yes, we are going to be doing like full glam. We're we doing glam. Is that what we're doing? We're doing glam. Yeah, we're doing it. We're going to do like a dark shadow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. So yeah, we're doing full glam and we're going to do my hair. And I was so appreciative because honestly, the Jackson content that we got was only epic because this person right here. Because the hair, the makeup, everything looked great. And also, when you were on the set, it was fire. All right, anyways, we're going to get started. Bye. Shardy's like a melody in my head that I can't keep on. kind of like introduction and on how I met Santos, I would say. Um, so Santos. I've, oh, is, did I say it wrong? <laughs> did I say it wrong? Santos. Did I say it with an A? Mm -hmm. Oh my fucking God. Long A, you said it's a short A. Santos. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, look. I'm super white and obviously I have no idea how to pronounce accent, so I'm gonna try. Super uncultured. Um, that's okay, we can start over. <laughs> um, I don't really feel like that's safe. I don't really feel like we should be. Yeah, wild. yeah, yeah. You know. If you would have fell through the window, I might yeah. have cried. Cam just decided like, to like sit. I can't explain that to Cam. Sit exactly sir. directly on the window. Like that would have been like the highlight oh of this God. trip. And there's the plenty highlight of, of the trip. Are you dying? Oh that dying. would have been like the yeah. That would have been like the scariest part of this trip. And everything scariest? about this trip has been bad. I know, but like that would be the worst. That would be the worst possible like outcome of this trip. And that would be it. It would be like a death. We'd I, don't, I don't know what the highlight I don't. Like I don't think I'm worried for it. I mean, like, we would get accused of murder, right? Well, how would I get accused of murder? He's the one that said it. Oh, no, 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 they have cameras in here, right? No, they don't. Oh. Where are the cameras? No, the guy that owns the place. No, he has a camera in the front door. Oh, I feel like, I feel like Wait, he's Wait, is that camera rolling right now? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Then I would so go. There would be anybody who's outside of the camera view. I would walk over to LA here, Center here. and be the security guard. Can we pull the footage, please? Because we need to just make sure that you know that no one pushed him. Oh my god. Can you imagine? Like, can you imagine me calling Kendall? Hey, uh, this weird thing happened where Cam sat on the edge of the left the window and he just fell out of the thing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Anyways. Look, I have ADD, but like that was a very ADD conversation. I feel like okay, we should just like scratch all of that. No, no, no it's fine. Um, but yeah, so anyways, I when did I when did I meet you officially? Well, actually, I met you officially two days ago. But like, when did we start chatting? Well, you and I. Like four years oh yeah. By ago. the way, can you? Uh, uh, yeah, you have to come in the video. Oh, yeah, yeah because you. you can't see. Yeah. So this is Christian. Yeah. Say hello. Wait, yeah, yeah, what's yeah. Up? So they're they're He's like, all right. Pff, they're brothers. Can you believe that? Shit. That's great. Wild. <laughs> um, so yeah, basically, because of Christian, I have been able to get in contact with Santos, I say right? Hey. Hey, okay. Um, and so basically, the content I did with Jackson was just fire because he was very helpful and I needed a lot of help. Um, but yeah, so basically, Christian and I have been in contact, what? Now we're holding symbols? Four years. Okay. Four years. We can talk. Oh, yeah. um, <laughs> I food in my mouth. Okay. Um, so yeah, like the last four years, and honestly, I've just, I've been, I would say, very appreciative of him supporting me because um, I, I really don't take, I would say, support, like, for granted. Um, I don't take people being very kind for granted as well, and so he's just honestly been one of those people that just very much so was kind of like riding with me, and honestly, I really don't know why, but, you know, he, he chose that, <laughs> and I appreciate that because, uh, you know, sometimes... I would say the social media world kind of gets to be, I don't want to say like like fake, but I do want to say fake. Mm, um, well, it's competitive, but it's sometimes it's like, you can kind of see someone's intentions right away. Um, and I've just kind of had to get better at, you know, if someone's messaging me, are they, you know, like, are they seeing me for me? Or like, is this just like a, a very like um, surface level type of a situation? Um, and so I would say like with Christian, it's never been surface level and I appreciate just who he is as a person. So, um, so yeah. Appreciate you. Thanks. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> See, I have a heart. Right. Yeah, yeah. Oh, great. Yeah. If you guys didn't know, I do have a heart. Thank you. Um, also, like, I know that you guys comment sometimes, like, you know, and I appreciate all the comments on, like, on the YouTube videos. 
Um, but maybe we could like change up some of the comments. Like maybe we could start saying things like, um, hey, Brenda, you did this really well. And hey, like this was really cool. You know, like the support, like on the YouTube comments, that would be super great. So like if you actually like the video, let me know. You know what I mean? Like don't like not say it, like tell me, mm -hmm. right? Because um, that means a lot to me. Thank you. Um, right. Look, look, we all know I'm not a YouTube expert, okay? Uh, I'm actually quite literally not an expert at anything. But like, if you want to see something, like, let me know. You know, don't, you know, you can't tell me that the camera's not sturdy anymore, okay? Look, it's on a tripod, all right? Like, I upgraded the content, okay? I, I'm doing you a favor so that you don't comment, hey, Miranda, you suck at this. So give me some feedback. Thank you very much. I don't know if you guys have ever seen where it's like- It's a state trooper. It's actually a real thing. I, I, I asked the cop last night. Who did you ask? My buddy who became a, like, he's a cop. Oh, okay. Is he a real one? No, he's a fake one. Okay. <laughs> did he like his job? Yeah, he okay. became a cop. He used to be a personal trainer and quit to be a cop. Okay. Um, do you Is think he all baby and yoke probably? Probably not. Semi. I don't want to say he's, he's decent. Oh, okay. I have Wait, a, I'm not a good person to ask that. <laughs> so the CHP was like, Back and forth. Yeah, so true basically, true. okay, wait, so we went, we, 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 before we left our friend's house, so, um, so Stor Stormy and I have been friends, um, we met each other through First Form, and honestly, she's just, she's just real as fuck, I like her, and we have always gotten along. Anyways, we go and hang out with, um, her and her husband, because they're just very good people. Um, so we drove over an hour to go see them, and, uh, before we left, we're like, okay, so we're gonna, we're gonna leave it at like 11 p.m. And she was having like her neck was kind of bothering her a little bit. So we were trying to be like respectful, <laughs> respectful of like their night and like let's not go to bed super late, yada yada. Long story short, that did not happen. Um, you know, at first, you know, we were bombarded with their very muscular Frenchies. I mean, I've never seen <laughs> I've never seen Frenchies that looked like they actually inject steroids into their body. Like, I kid you not, I've never seen that in my entire life. Um, that was something that I had to actually process because. Um. I have seen Frenchies and like normally they're, they're like this cute like little like weird looking dog but it's like cute but like it's not it's like, weird. weird looking yeah and then but like they're cute and they do this like really hefty breathing where it's like <laughs> like they're so ugly that they're cute yeah but like they breathe like humans and like that throws me off but when I saw these little like they're, they're like little trolls and I'm not trying to be like rude but like they're like like then they're very very stocky and like. I don't know, like, it, it, like so muscular, like it was, a, it was crazy. I had to take that in. So like that took way too much time for me personally. Um, and then we just kind of got lost in translation with all these conversations and like talking about like real things and like, you know, really great stuff. Um, and then all of a sudden it's like two o'clock in the morning and then it's like, and now it's like three o'clock in the morning and now it's like three 30 in the morning. We're like, Oh my God, we should probably leave. <laughs> Weird. 7 a.m. Um, Michigan, or not Michigan. Florida. Same Sorry. Thing. Look, look, I used to, you know. I was like, Michigan? Yeah, We're well, you Michigan. know. I know. Same, it's the same time zone, actually. Yeah, same time zone. See, her mind is just on home, though. She's yeah. like, I just want to go home. So, yeah, anyways, um, so we leave at 3.30 in the morning. <laughs> um, and then also, something else that, like, is just another, like, block is uh, our, the rental car we have is just, it, someone died in there, something died in there, I'm not sure what it was, Are what you it serious? is. No. Oh, absolutely, yeah. Oh, you have a a rodent like dies in the air vent, and it smells like a disgusting odor, and I can't wait to turn back in this rental car and have the guy smell it so I can get some money back. I can't wait to watch this, maybe we should film that. Because it smells that bad. And it's been gotten to progressively worse over this week. Wow. Yeah, every day we go in there, it's worse. And like we, we can't find where the smell's coming from. We're like, oh, it's the air vent. And then it's like, no, like, it's not the air vent. Yeah. Something's inside the car dying. Yeah. I just, we just don't know what. It's either rotten milk. It's, it smells like a moldy breath. Yeah. Oh, Lucas, no, it doesn't. Gross. It smells like a rotten body. It doesn't smell like a moldy, rotten body smells like. moldy breath. What even is that? I don't know. I, the, where did you I smell that? It smells, it smells more like mold. It does not smell like a dead body. Like we, we're getting sidetracked here. So yeah, the car smells really bad. Um, we had to get in this smelly car that we have. Look, this trip has not been ideal like in any way, shape, or form, like at all. Nothing has gone to plan ever. Uh, we're just kind of like winging it at this point. Um, so yeah, long story short, uh, we're like driving home. We're all tired as fuck, well, you know, tired. So we have a long drive home. We're on the freeway, and this cop, like, just. What did he first do at first? Like he just no, started so weaving? Effort, it's like he was swerving know. across a five lane highway. Yeah, he was like doing from this. From like the median yeah. all the way to the far side of the median. It was like median yeah. to median. Yeah. But it was like 3 a.m. He did it for like a mile. So this cop's swerving across a five lane highway. 
literally for a mile, and then his car tried to pass him, and he stops weaving, gets on a speaker and goes, if you get close to me, I'm going to give you a ticket. So every car stops, <coughs> we slowly inch with him, and all of a sudden there's this big accident on like the left side of the median that's taking up no space on the highway, and they shut down the entire highway at 3 a.m. <coughs> for 30 minutes. It was so dramatic. Like it was. For like, no, it was oh like, all God. you had to do was block off one lane, but instead of blocking off one lane, these state troopers are like, let's make everyone's life an inconvenience. That's yeah, yeah that's here. That's California. California. Wait, is that not a thing in Florida, or Detroit? Or that was my I, next I, question. I, I've never seen. That was my I've next question. Seen a, I've never <laughs> seen a state trooper try to like assert their authority like they had to show that they had this like massive ego. And like, don't well, get me like, don't get me wrong. Like, obviously, something well, happened. Like, something like, happened that was very serious. You know, like. Like, obviously, I'm, like, concerned, like, is someone needing help? Like, what's going on? The car, like, that was, you know, into the wall, it, like, was, looked like it had, was very smashed. Yeah. You know, it's like, that's obviously concerning. It's just, it wasn't all over the road. It was just, like, in one lane. Mm -hmm. And then the cop just decided to be like, you know what? I don't care. I don't want you guys to go to sleep tonight. I don't fucking care. So we're going to just keep <laughs> swerving and doing this whole thing. You know, and then we're just kind of sitting there. We sat there for at least 30 minutes, right? And then another cop came and a fire truck came. Yeah, so like then, then like, you know, the whole city was there, basically. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, and then, and then, then the highway was just started backing up and ca as the cars were coming up on the median trying to figure out, like, it's 3 a.m. Why are we stopped on the highway? And the cop then pulls up again and goes, you must think you're special if you can drive on the median. Oh, man, I love that you did that. Because that, that's what he did. He literally did that. And we're all like, we're all like, oh, like, this cop's kind of like trying to be funny. Like, bro, it's 3 a.m. We're either yeah. going to work or people like us want to go to bed. Yeah. yeah. And I'm not trying to be on the highway at 3 a.m. I'm already falling asleep. Yeah, yeah it's crazy. So, yeah, we didn't get home until 4.30. Like, what? 4.30. Which is 7.30. Or Sick, yeah. And I kept waking up. Like, I set an alarm for myself. I'm not even sure why. I kept waking up, I'm like, damn, it's only night. Okay, we're doing the smoky eye. Yeah, sure. Well, I'm doing the smoky eye right now. So it's the smoky eye, but Miranda used to do this back in college, more like the darker eyes, so you, you need to see how you do it in four. What are you talking about? Brandon, you used to do that dark eyeshadow in college with the dark lipstick. Well, Miranda has a really great crease, mm -hmm. natural crease. So I went in and I wanted to, um, oh, look, I'm, I've lost all my, all my terms. Like when I worked at Mac, it just came out so sick in nature. Yeah. And then I feel like the pandemic hit and then you, and then you everybody was yeah. home, and I think there was like this, this, this social awkwardness that that yeah, somewhat came over everybody because yeah. you're like. So I'm finding that with myself, like coming out now, yeah. it's like okay, like I'm I'm having to relearn all of this because yeah. I was a public speaker prior to the pandemic yeah. and all of that. Yeah. So I'm like having to you know yeah. relearn all yeah. this. But guess this what? new that, kind that's of normal stuff. Normal though, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's, it makes you human. You're not supposed to like always have all the answers and like be perfect at every, every yeah no and that wasn't the point of this video but honestly the point of this video is um you know i feel that i haven't been able to show i would say more of a feminine side since i've been doing this because you know i've always like you know lifted heavy and i've done you know all the things uh in the gym and so i kind of just felt like when it came to going out or even getting dressed up it was kind of like you know at that point I wasn't going to get content of me going out because I had already just been doing content all day. <laughs> um, and so it was just kind of like I would go out, you know, in my earlier 20s, um, and not to get content, but I still cared about my outfits. Like I still, I still was passionate about, you know, trying to like look good, you know. Um, and so, you know, now, now that I have a little bit more of a control of like the content that I can put out, you know, I do want to show my, my other sides of my personality, not just in the gym and you know trying to you know lift as much as Lucas because we're pretty much the same strength you know, so. um, but yeah no I just would say like it's you don't have to be you don't have to be perfect on social media you don't have to there's like no right way to say or do something it's just however you want to go about it is, is normal I'm just trying to show them that like you know yeah I can like lift weight and I can do all that stuff, but I can also be, you know, feminine when I want to. Um, that's kind of like the point of this video. So I can't really see what it looks like, so it's just kind of weird, but I hope it looks good. So. That's plum, you were saying? 
Yeah, now I'm going in with the plum. So she has a really beautiful eye crease, so I wanted to define that. So I went with the neutral brown color to define the eye crease. Love and that. then I wanted to start um, on her eyelid, but I wanted to kind of like take it deeper step by step. So I went with like a neutral brown um, over the lid and smoked that out with a, um, notice the difference in the I love the smoke. It looks good on your face. It does look good. Yeah. So, what so I use this to create the crease. Okay. To create the crease. And then I wanted to concentrate the color on the eyelid. So I went with the flatter brush and concentrated the color and actually like packed it on to yeah. get that purple. So now we're in the deep plums. Down? Down? Oh, down, no, sorry. I would say I can't follow directions. <laughs> and then when I get to her, her bottom waterline, I'm going to bring this color back in okay. to the picture yeah. and blend all the eyes together. Yeah, okay, cool. Okay. Shadow is it's very um, like it makes my eyes like open more. It does. I have very head, like I have very deep eyes. Yeah, but it makes your eyes look very like, color. Like I can see the color. Yeah, in your eyes. but I have like very naturally hazed eyes and like it's like a joke, but like I've gotten told that I look high twenty four seven my whole life, so it's like nice to have like open you... eyes. So what color? What color choices did you choose? Like a mauve. Well, you you like to play with those. Yeah, so yeah. I'm going with a little bit more of a um, brown lip. Okay. You like to play with, with the mobbies a little too much, I'm just taking you out of there a little bit. All right, all right. That fire. For your... Yeah. All right, I think my eyeshadow is like, this is probably the best my eyeshadow has ever looked. Oh, it looks so good. Did you say sleepy? What? We can wake you up. Oh no, I said this is the best my eyeshadow has ever looked. We can wake you Oh, okay. I'm like, yeah, sleepy, yeah, no. we can wake you up. Oh no, no, that looks good. You killed this. You like it? Yeah, Thank you. you. Seriously, give me a hug. Like you killed it. Seriously. Like, thank thank you, you so much. All right, we are going to wrap this up. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Yes, love that. Um, I hope to do more of these in the in the future. I'm gonna try to pave my way here because I like doing I like doing content like this. Like I'm not just you know like in person. You know I can can be other things. But anyways, I'm gonna wrap this up and I appreciate you guys so much. And let me know what you guys want to see next. Bye.